My friend Ringo asked me to stretch brachialis for him. When I palpated his bicep, I could feel brachialis as a slippery little lump underneath the bicep, down near the elbow. It had been a problem for quite some time. I have placed him in the standard bicep stretch position, but with the addition of a yoga block underneath the back of his wrist, like so. I ask him to get into the full bicep stretch position, which he has done by rolling himself back away from the floor and using the other arm to support the other shoulder in the push-up position, like this. He brings on the bicep stretch by rolling himself backwards. I reposition his head on the floor for maximum comfort and then gently start to lean weight on the upper arm part of this equation. So I'm leaning about five kilograms, I would say roughly, on his upper arm. And because his, the back of his wrist is supported on the yoga block, the elbow is not touching the floor yet, the inside of the elbow, I should say. Then I ask Ringo to pull his wrist down onto the block as though he was trying to bring the back of his hand to his face and I stop the elbow bending. Now I'm putting a bit more weight on the elbow to resist the tendency for the elbow to pop away from the floor while he applies this force. Then he stops contracting. I say take in a deep breath, relax completely, and on a breath out, use your own tricep muscle, the one I'm leaning on, to try to press the inside of your elbow closer to the floor. And this is what he's doing now. And as you can see, the elbow hyperextends just the right amount, something he's not been able to do for the last year or so. It is absolutely essential not simply to press the elbow into hyperextension, but to ask the person you're working with to use their own triceps to do this. Then, gently, he comes out of the position, and then he will compare the degree of hyperextension in the left and the right elbow. Ah, look at that. Now they're exactly the same.